So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and transfer over iPad videos or photos over to your Windows PC. Now doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. Now there's ways to do it. You can transfer it via, you know, using the you know, iTunes application or anything like that. My favorite way of transferring stuff is via just like some websites. So if you're able to go ahead and make your way over on your iPad, what we're going to want to do is we want to start off on our iPad and we want to make our way over to this website, which is called PearDrop.net. So just go ahead and make your way over to PearDrop.net. There's a lot of other these types of websites on your iPad. Then what you're going to want to do is on your Windows PC, you want to go to the same exact website. So go over into your browser of some sort and go ahead and type in PearDrop.net here as well. So you can go right here, type in PearDrop, just like this, and you want to go and click on here. As long as you're connected to the same Wi-Fi connection, you should be able to see it come up on both of them. So you can see for me right now, because I'm connected to the same Wi-Fi connection, you can see that I have it on both. Now what I want to do is on my iPad, the place I have the photos or videos, I want to go ahead and tap onto that particular you know, photo option right here, and I want to click on Photo Library Choose Files. In this case, in this case I'm going to choose Photo Library, and now I can go and tap on this photo. You can tap as many photos as you want to here. Let's go and click on Add. And now watch what happens. It now basically automatically transfers over to my Windows PC. So now what I can do is I can go ahead and click on Accept, and it will go ahead and allow me to download this image. And you will see I've now just downloaded this image right here in a matter of seconds. So this is just one photo. You can transfer as many photos as you want to. Keep in mind, it does take a little bit of time. The more photos and videos you send, the longer it takes. But this is by far the easiest way, I would say, of transferring a lot of photos and videos wirelessly from an iPad to a Windows PC. So in terms of that, that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.